Hey everybody, I'm at the Cliff Mine in Michigan's Keweenaw Peninsula today. Uh, this is an old copper mine, and I've been here once before, but to be honest with you, I'm kind of out of my element. Uh, don't really know how to search mines like I do beaches. Uh, so if you know more than I do, by all means, say something. Um, I do have a rock hammer, so that makes me feel official. But anyhow, this is, uh, was a mine that was opened in 1844. I found something on the internet that said that it closed in 1870, although I don't know how accurate that is. So anyhow, let's go check it out. So and there's a big pile of rocks. I think the first thing to do is climb to the top which is probably exactly what everybody else does, so it might not be the best method. Well, it's really windy today, so hopefully you can hear something. All right, I'm trying to get out of the wind by hiding behind a pile of rocks. Uh, some of the rocks that you can find here, supposedly, uh, doesn't mean that I'm gonna find them, but data light would be awesome if I could find that. Uh, the other big one is Isle Royal Greenstone, or Pompeliite. I think that's how you say that, something like that. Uh, but anyhow, that's a, a real, that's Michigan's gemstone, state gemstone. Uh, beautiful rock, but I don't know how to recognize it in Matrix, not polished up. So I might, if I see something green, I might take it home uh, and just play around with it. Uh, you can also find Prenite here which I know what it looks like on the beach, but again, I'm not sure if I know how to recognize it in a rough form like this. Here's something that somebody broke open. Don't know what that is. Uh, the green might be epidote, but I really don't know. I'm at the back side of this pile, and I just found what appears to be part of a man-made wall here. So I'm gonna walk around and see if I can find some ruins. Here's the other side of that wall. It's kinda cool. It appears to be roughly square, or at least rectangular. Kind of caved in there. There's like a path here too, so I'm gonna walk down this path and see what I can find. Oh, here's another building over here. Oh, this is cool. No idea what I'm seeing here, but it's a very nicely made wall. I have stone walls in my backyard that I built that are not as good as this. It's very cool. So that's some sort of chimney. I'm guessing maybe copper was melted down here at one point.
just a short distance from that chimney, I found another wall. And I don't know what's at the top of the hill here yet. Not much. I'm continuing to follow a path into the woods. Looks like there's a little spring here. And I have no idea where this goes, if it goes anywhere. It's coming right out of the ground right there. You know, looks like a lot of people walked up the hill, so I'm going up the hill. Well, I've run into a cliff. It's pretty cool. Still going up. Kind of clear off to my right. Looks like more tailings kind of falling down the side of the hill here. I climbed a lot higher than I thought I did. Can you see the Jeep down there? I can just barely see it, and with this wide angle lens, you probably can't see it at all. There's quite the view from up here. All right, time to check out some rocks again. Uh, the orange in here, my guess is feldspar, but that's just a guess. I'm guessing that this rock is basalt. Probably should have done some research before walking up here. There's some green stuff in there. Like I said, I don't know what green stone looks like in its natural form, or its rough form. That could be some, I don't really know. Uh, this one down here looks sort of promising, but it's kind of a big rock. like that, possibly. Little pieces in there. But I really don't know what I'm doing. And I don't want to haul 50 pounds of rock down the hill and find out that it's nothing. I just decided that standing up here on the top of this hill was a good time to do some research about cliff mines. So I just looked it up and according to Wikipedia, uh, this was the first successful copper mine up here in copper country, up in the Keweenaw. Uh, and from 1845 to 1854, it was the most productive copper mine in the United States. And I also looked up on Mindat and there are 40 minerals listed that can be found here. Well, I just pulled this out. Don't know if that's copper. It's kind of kind of bendy, but kind of brittle. I think that might be a little piece of green copper. Oh yeah, there's some some color right there. I don't know if you can see that. That's neat. Just dug this up. Which I'm pretty sure is copper kind of bendy here. See it? And it's green. And I think it's copper. Yay! You may know what this orange stuff is. It's a very crumbly rock. I don't know what that is. I have no idea what I'm doing.
looking at a lot of rocks. But I don't know what I'm looking at. Like there's a little green in the bottom of that one. Is that green stone? Don't know. I need me miner here with this metal detector. If you can find silver, it could probably find copper too. I know it could find copper. Wouldn't help with the green stones though. There's malachite here. I don't think in any kind of quantity, but I saw that on the list. There's a bunch of green. I'm guessing this rock is either basalt or rhyolite. That's cool. All right, so I decided I didn't know what the heck I'm doing. I took a few little copper flakes with me and I'm heading back down the hill. Mosquitoes are eating me up and I'm trying not to twist an ankle. Trees made some woodpeckers very happy. Part way down now, just thought I'd show you the pile from this perspective. I'm back down at the bottom now, and I found another wall. I saw a big metal like smokestack from up on top coming out of these trees somewhere. So I'm going in looking for it. It's weird that I can't see it from down here. Does it look like it was sticking up above the trees? There's something over there, another chimney for smelting or something. Okay, I'm enjoying the ruins here more than the than the uh, rocks. There's that metal pipe coming up out of the middle of the rocks there. I think that's what I saw. Somebody's built a fork or something over here.
just walked a little further and found something that looks a little more modern. It's concrete. There's a big bolt sticking out of it. And I don't know what's over here. the entrance to the mine for a second. I don't know where the entrance is. Ooh, this is cool. Hey, it looks like I'm going to do some reading when I get home and find out what all this stuff is. That looks like somebody ripped it apart. I have no idea what that's doing there. Nicely constructed wall, anyhow. Very flat front face on it. Curved, but kind of smooth. Okay, I'm back. Uh, I was up in this area here a little while ago, and now I'm back down and heading home. All I brought home was a couple little pieces of copper uh, because I really didn't know what anything else was and I didn't want to bring home a bunch of stuff to clutter up my basement So it stayed there. Thanks for coming along with me